Paul's Idol Review Show. Yay! Okay, here we are. First time in a long time. We're actually filming on Friday, so I do know who was eliminated. That said, the theme this week was then and now, and I just want to get straight to my favorite performance of the night. Holy hot mama. Yeah, that's right, Elise. I know the judges didn't give her a whole lot of love for it, but she's saying, let's get it on, and yeah. Oh, okay. I... Hey, how you doing there? Hi. So, uh, what are you doing here? No, 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 settle down, she's 28. And even so, uh, the next day, she tweeted this photo, which, <sighs> anyway, moving along, Jessica Sanchez and- Jessica Sanchez, huh? Minor Jessica Sanchez? Stop it. Oh, I forget Jessica Sanchez. Um, Holly Cavanaugh. She was finally good. I was so happy to see that. And you know what? When she sang Son, Son of a Preacher Man and she started walking down those stairs, uh, she was looking pretty... She was looking pretty what, Paul? You know what? Forget it. Uh, let's just skip to the results. The big shocking elimination was Colton. Um, yeah, they, they, nobody was expecting it. Uh, even though I've been kind of predicting it for a while, it made sense. He even explained it. He understood it because uh, he's a very devout Christian. Singing Bad Romance by Lady Gaga is probably uh, what made his audience not want to vote for him. So uh, it's kind of a bummer, though. Uh, I might think that's a ridiculous reason not to vote for somebody. But he does seem like a really nice kid. You know, he's cute and... All right, that's it. What, what, why don't you just have a seat over there? Just, just have a seat over there. No, no, I, I'm out of here. Get him, boys! Get him, boys!